Hello, horsey people, and we're back with Horse Reality. Yeah, love this online game as it is free. It's a free online game, and the best bit about this game is the colour genetics. Yeah, I kid you not, it's amazing. So, guys, the last video I did of this, I sold all my horses, and I wanted to start afresh with you guys, and I'm still unsure of what to do. <laughs> so, uh, if we go to the market, it seems that horses are really expensive. If I uh, show you guys here how much money I have though, I have quite a lot of money. So I shouldn't really worry about that. I'm just thinking, do I start a horse breed from the foundation or from the wildlife park and completely start one from scratch and work my way up? Or should I just buy one that's already a good level and then focus on breeding colours? Hmm. This is the difficulty that I have, you see. So, <laughs> I kind of feel like I just want to get going into a breed like straight away. And also, I'm really not sure what breed to do still. So, we're going to have a little look today. We're going to look through all the breeds, what's on offer, what's actually for sale. We're going to look for... Oh, I'm not worried, actually, if it's an adult or foal. I'm going to look for a mare, though, guys. I'm going to look for a mare. I'm not overly worried about discipline either. But I do want to get something that has a uh, good confirmation did i say that right he is a beautiful horse i i'm kind of going towards the knob stripper breed a little bit or possibly the arabian breed i know some of you guys wanted me to do the fjord breed as well and i've just seen this one this one's just popped up i quite like this um i'm not too sure on the artwork here the horse looks a little bit strange i don't know why but um, I want something that's got really cool colours. Now, I, I've already done the Gypsy Vanna breed and also some other some other breeds I've done as well. Um, I haven't done the Icelandic yet, but I don't really like the look of them when they get older. I think they look a little bit strange. Um, that's just my opinion. The Welsh Pony is also calling out to me, but also the Finn Horse looks really nice. I'm really confused. <laughs> what breed? Do you guys play the game? And if you do, what breeds do you do? So we're going to have a look here. Oh, look at this one. I did do the quarter horse for a while, but I kind of feel like I just touched on it. I didn't really breed it properly. So that's another option because, again, the colouring is really, really cool. Um, but I think I'm going to go and try and buy in at the best straight away. Just because I have the money and, yeah, I just want to get breeding and all that malarkey. Because, obviously, we need some foals, guys. So... Um, I'm very confused. Let's go through all the breeding. Now, this pure raza española uh, breed is beautiful, to be fair. Let's check that one out. Let's just go through all the breeds individually and see if there's anything. Um, I would purchase premium if we could have more stables. Because it's a bit annoying, otherwise the limit. The al alatique is actually stunning, isn't it? What colour is this? Oh, look how beautiful that is. I did actually do this breed for a while and it was stunning look at the colors guys look at the colors so i'm just showing you guys what we possibly have here as an option for breeding and colors and all that kind of let's go to page eight let's just see what's at the back here so i don't think you can get like patterned horses i know you get a lot of the cremello colors and a lot of this like sort of metallic -y colors which is really wicked okay guys this is probably number one number two choice of the game oh my gosh look at this one I love this colour. <gasps> okay. Um, the Arab is probably number one. Ding ding, number one at the moment. Especially if we get a horse like this. What colour is this horse? This is beautiful. Um, another thing that would be cool about the game is n if they had names for the colours and a checklist of all the colours. I think that'd be really wicked. Look, you get a nice dapple grey here. He's actually beautiful. Is he going to go grey when he gets older? Do you think that's what's going to happen here? So achievements, yeah, look. Now, I know it already said in the description here what he has, but sometimes people lie about <laughs> these stats. So what you're looking for in the confirmation here, guys, is um, as many very goods as possible. Now, this is, this is very good. This is very good. Um, it's a very nice horse, and as you can see, it's coming fast in all of its stuff. So this would probably be a horse to buy at some point. If we decided on the Arab breed, I would definitely probably buy her. I think that would be a good 
a good thing to do. And there's loads of colours with the Arabs. This is what I'm loving about it. I mean, look at this one. Guys, look at this one. <gasps> so pretty. So, um, I don't know what the future of horse reality is. I don't know if they're going to bring in more breeds. I don't know. It does say in the wiki, if you go here in this general and click on the wiki, uh, it does say that there are future breeds, but I think that's been there quite a while, so I'm not sure. Uh, okay, so the Arab is definitely like, it's on the top list there. Um, how do you say this? Barbara? Barbara? <laughs> Oh dear. Oh, I'm not sure on this. I mean, it's a stunning horse. It looks rare. What? There's hardly any of them. But I don't think the colour variation on them is, like, enough for me. Brumby. I kind of had some of these. Hmm. They're, aren't they basically Mustang horses? Have they got the same picture, actually? But these are good, aren't they? Because they've got cool colours as well. Hmm. If I was going to get a wild horse breed, I'd actually quite like to work my way through through the stats. Look at this colour though guys! Oh wow! That's a really cool colour. Don't know why, it reminds me of a jelly bean and I don't know why. How much? What? It's only £5,000. Uh, see, confirmation, not good. See, I think because I want to breed for the confirmation and everything just so I know I'm breeding good horses. I'm not really worried about the Camarouge horse. Let's have a look. How do you say this? Camarouge? Because you don't get like that many like colours again. So, yeah, not really bothered about that. Let's just show you guys the Cleveland Bay horse. Ah, uh, they're all bay. That's that's the problem. Exmoor ponies, they're all pretty much the same colour. Should I show you guys anyway? I wasn't going to them, but I will show you guys. Um, yeah, as you can see, they're all the same colour. Um, Finn horse actually started to be standing out to me a little bit recently. Look, they're kind of cool. Oh, cool! You get this kind of like uh. What do you call that? Splash? Oh, I like this one. Oh, I like you a lot. The Finn horse is standing out to me now. What do I do? Oh, this is tough. It's a hard knock knife for us. We've got to choose a breed. But I don't know what to choose. Oh my gosh, look at this. They're pretty. Okay, I quite like, okay, maybe these are coming up in my list. Look at this one. Is this grey? Or is this like, oh, that's really nice. Oh my gosh, so he's £10,000 and he's got, oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh. Okay, so I'm just showing you guys the breeds right now, but the artwork is insane on this game. So you guys, a lot of you guys wanted me to do Fjord, so just comment what breeds you want me to do. Um, I probably won't do Fjord. Wait, there's a black one. Is that really rare? Are you rare? I'm so, I'm so confused. Are you a really rare horse? And it's got... Uh, it's okay. It's not really... The foal is really, like, too cute. But I didn't know you could get black ones. That's crazy. Um, So I reckon that black one's quite rare. Um, Frisian's obviously going to be, like, black. In shades of black. And the odd brown. Yeah. So I'm not overly worried about those either. They are beautiful horses, however. Halflinger horse. My mum has always wanted one of these. She loves them. She thinks she's, she thinks they are beautiful. We went on a riding holiday to Wales once, and um, I, when I was a little kid, I must have been about ten, I got given this halflinger, and it was rapid. Right. Um. Oh, I know. Well, the Icelandic are nice, but I just think they look a little bit, a little bit strange. I think the color, colors on them though, is very good. Like, I think there's a lot of options here for colors, but I just, I kind of feel like. Yeah, they look a bit weird. Um, the Irish cob I've already done, and uh, how do we uh, pronounce this? Cal, 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 da, 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 da. Okay, we're gonna call it that. Ooh, these are quite nice. What colours do we get with these though? It doesn't. I mean, I sort of just scanning through. Obviously, these are the only ones that are like for sale. Doesn't look like there's too much colour variation going on with this breed. Uh, just comment below what breed you guys do. If you play, if you play this game, and this is actually uh, number one or number two as well, the Canab Stripper, because you get loads of different colours with this. Oh my gosh, look at this one! <gasps> I want that. I want it. Hundred thousand. Oh wow! <gasps> I like that one a lot. You guys know I'm all about an Appaloosa. Me. I think Appaloosa is coming to the game. I think. I can't, oh my gosh, look, it's got little tiny spots, it's so cute. Um, depending on price of things, 
I think it might be this breed, but I'm not sure yet. Let's just keep working our way through and see. Lus How do you say this? Lustitano? Lustitano? I've always said it as Lustiano, but I can imagine it's wrong because I spell and say everything wrong. Ooh, look at this colour of this one. Oh, is it Fleabin? Is it Fleabin? If it was mine, I'd call it popcorn. So, these are nice. They've got cool colours. Let's just go to a random page here and just see what other colours we have. Yeah, so you've got loads of Palominos and stuff like that. And yeah, I just, I don't know. I don't know what to do. So there's loads of colours here, but there aren't any patterns, if you know what I mean. Because I think if we had patterns, there'd be more options. Mustang has definitely got really cool different colours. <laughs> oh, I even like this one. I already uh, did quite a lot of the Mustang breed once, like about three years ago, when I was... I've kind of been on and off this game, you see, for ages. Um, what is this breed? Nokia. Nor... Norika. How do you say it, guys? Uh, he looks amazing. Oh my gosh. He reminds me of the Brea horse horses, those little toys. Oh, look at this one. Okay, this is just popped out of the blue. Um, okay, this is cool, okay, oh, I love this colour, this is probably my favourite colour, I don't know whether these are, like, sticking out to me now, look, you get spotted ones as well, they're cute, I really like them, uh, let's check out any more colours, let's go to page three a second, let's see what else we've got, if we can maybe get one really decent mat, oh yeah, look, you get different patterns as well, Oh, now I'm not so sure. What is this one? Wow, you are beautiful as well. Okay, guys, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to carry on. And I might even roll a dice at this rate. Because it's now between three breeds. And I don't know. I don't know what to do. Uh, this one's nice. This is the Normandy Cobb. Norman Cobb. Norman Cobb. I haven't really um ever looked at this breed, ever. They look really smart to be fair, but again, I can't see much colour variation going on there. This one is the Oldenburg horse. I mean, this was actually ticking my boxes as well. I mean, look, you get patterns, you get, yeah, you get loads of stuff going on here, guys. It's awesome. And I just clicked some random stuff there. I like it, but I feel like a lot of people do this breed, so I'd like to do something that's like a little bit rarer. This is the uh, Pura Raza Española. <laughs> I'm trying guys, I'm trying. So let's look at the colours here. See I'm I'm sold, but there aren't any are there any there wouldn't be any patterns. I don't think there's patterns in much Spanish horses, are there? Like I don't think there are. Where do patterns come from? Like where did that breeding come from? Crazy, isn't it? The quarter horse has my heart, I'm not gonna lie. I do love this. I love the colours. I think the colours are amazing in the quarter horse. So I might even like revert back to them, but I would be kicking myself because I did have four mares with like <laughs> really good stats. And I sold them because I was like, oh, I'm having a restart. Oh, I wish I hadn't done that. Okay, um, yeah, love the Shires. Is this a little Palomino Shire? Oh, it's so cute. If that was mine, I'd call him Goldie. Um, I'm not overly worried about Shires. I like them, I really like them, but um, I don't, there's not, again, not as enough, uh, not enough colour. Suffolk Punch is all the same colour. Now, Suffolk Punch are actually a dying out breed, aren't they, guys? Aren't they nearly extinct or something? There's not many of them left in the world, which is kind of sad. Ah, Trakena horse. Now, my friend had one of these, actually, um, when we were growing up. It was ever so light, like, in its footwork. I know it sounds really weird, but it was like... It sort of floated along, beautiful. Um, okay, so they've got some cool colours with this as well. I'm, mm, I'm loving this. I'm liking this actually, guys. Is it all Tobiano horses, or are there any other colours? This one's quite nice. Um, anything that's really standing out to me? Let's go to page sixteen. Looks like it's a really popular breed, which is sometimes a good thing and a bad thing, obviously, because uh, it means you're going to be able to get uh, higher leveled horses easier. But it also means you're probably not going to make as much money in them. Oh, look at this cute little one. Oh, with four white matching socks. Oh, it's cute. Okay, I don't want to do myself there. Uh, we haven't got many left. Uh, yeah, we've only got the Welsh Pony left, guys. Cute. Okay, let me show you guys. 
This one's also kind of been on my list, but I think they re need to redo the art with this one, don't they? This looks like the old art. Oh, cute. That's cool. It's got like a cool like little hairdo there. Um, I do like the Welsh. I'm confused, guys. This is so difficult. I don't know what to do. The Welsh are really nice. Okay, I'm confused. <sighs> okay, it's not going to be the Welsh. I've decided it's not going to be the Welsh. I'm going to go back to this Finn horse here. Okay. Ooh. Okay, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Can you get like a normal, like, Tobiano horse, Finn horse? Can you do that? Can you get like normal, like, patterns? Oh, these are so nice. These are really nice, but. Oh, no, I really like them. Okay, okay. Let's write off the Finn horse. Let's go. The other one I wanted was Arabian Canab Strapper. Just go back to the Arabian, but I kind of feel like everyone does the Arabian. Do you guys know what I mean? Everyone does it. But there are some beautiful colours and I love this one here. <gasps> I don't know what to do with myself. I just don't know what to do. I want this one too. Yeah, some really nice colours in the Arabs. Arabians. The It was the Kardruba ones, wasn't it? That I can, can't say. They were really nice. I really liked these, but again, it wasn't much in the way of colours, was it, guys? Uh, let's go with... Um, where's the other one I wanted? Oh my gosh. Kanab. Kanab, Kanab, Kanab. Kind of want to do this. I prefer the artwork of the males than I do the females, I must admit. Um, oh, look how cute this one is. <laughs> I want this one. I might just buy it. Not for 100,000, that's a bit steep. Um, and the other one was the Nokia horse, wasn't it? That's right. That's what it was, guys. And was it this one that you could actually get the, like, few spots with? Or was that just the Kanab, Kanabi knob? I think, guys, we are just completely out of the blue. I never thought I'd do this breed. But I think we're going we're gonna to try this breed. So I'm just going to go through <laughs> now, guys. This is where the fun begins. We're going to try and get um, a mare. Let's go mare. I want a mare. Um, because then you can breed said mare with an awesome stallion. And then you have two horses, hopefully, that are as good. Uh, let's go for something. If we can find something over four, very, four or more very goods, then I'm all up for that. And if it's a cool colour as well, yep, yeah, I'm so up for that. Ah, oh, okay, so I'm not the best at breeding for genetics. Um, I kind of just enjoy it being a little bit like, woohoo, like, oh, I'll just breed with this, oh, I'll be fine. I kind of like the whole pick and mix idea. This is nice. I mean, um, let's just check out the horse a second. So you're for sale, you're three very good. See, that's not quite good enough for me, actually. So let's go back. Ooh, I do like these, but... Can you get Nokia horses as a foundation horse? I wonder if you can. Let's just see if there's anything. Now you've got four very good here. Buy out, 15,000. <sighs> Ooh. Fair enough, well, that's okay. Six very good here. Oh, 35,000, that's okay. Uh, let's go, let's check out this number six here. So I know it's not the most interesting of colors, but they haven't lied on their report either, but there's one average, guys. Okay, I don't think you're worth 35,000 if you've got one average in there. Sorry. I'm sorry. So we're going to buy for something... Yeah, I... Um, I kind of want to check out the uh, foundations now, but the, you could end up with it being absolutely terrible. I want a spotted one as well. Okay, female spots. Uh, let's just check you out. I nearly accidentally bought her then. Oh, not good, guys. Not good. So, um, let's just go to a second. Let's go to the foundation. Can you get Norkias as a foundation? So, guys, these are the foundation horses. Uh, this is kind of like the breed you can start up from scratch, I suppose. Is that right? Is that how you guys would do it? That's a Karuba. Kanab Strapper. I do like those, I must admit. I might even just buy one of those. 
<gasps> you can buy them! But, big but, uh, they're all stallions. And they could end up being like anything. Uh, let's have a look. Quarter horses, Shire, Suffolk Punch, Tracane horses, Trackner, what have you set. I kind of want to buy this thing. I like the look of this. Have I accidentally just bought that? I really like him. Is he grey? What is he? Is he grey? I like him. Oh, his family tree is cool. If I buy him, we've only lost £5,000, right? So, why don't we just buy him? I kind of want a mare, though. How do you, does it refresh every day? Does it refresh? Um, I want a female. That's what I want. So then I can breed with them. I'm scared. I don't know what to do. Let's go back to the market. Okay, guys. I know this is painful. Oh, making a decision is so hard. I definitely want that breed, though. I've definitely decided that. Weirdly. I never in a million years thought that it would be this breed. I just think they're cute. I think they're really cute. Um, right. Okay, let's just see. Let's go. So you can have premium search options, which... I think you should be able to have them anyway, even if you don't pay for premium. I mean, it just makes your game flow better and everything, which means you want to invest more in the game, surely. Anyway, so this is... Oh, he said one average. So they, they didn't lie here. That was good. It's nice of them. Um, There's a two very good. I, I Maybe I need to just, like, set my standards a bit lower. It's just for £15,000, I think that's quite a lot. So I'm just going to buy out horses today, guys. I haven't got time to wait. Let's check you out. You could be... Oh, trade's not valid. Oh, well, that went well. Okay, oh, I like a fold. I like a... Mu She's got, like, all these little spots under here. Oh, my gosh, this colouring is cool. Um. Okay, let's just check out the achievements here. Achievements aren't great. So, I just don't want anything that has... But basically, I want, like, no averages. I want all either, like good or above I think I think that's what I want so like this guy here and this this is a female as well so that's good she's cute isn't she I love how they're doing like a little dramatic row one two three very good and the rest are okay check out your family tree kind of cool coloring um come out like your mum haven't you um three and nine Beauty one? Really? Three and nine and they want £2,000 for it? Really? Let's just double check it guys because you never know. People could be lying. No? They weren't lying. That's good. Okay, let's give that... Where's it gone? Uh, let's give this person an offer. Make an offer. Oh, help if I put a number in. Let's just put uh, 2200. Zero, zero. Make an offer. I'm a bit annoyed at myself though, guys, because I did actually uh, sell my horses quite cheap. I just wanted a fresh start, you know. So do you guys ever get like that where you're like, I just want a new start, blah, blah, blah. Um, This one's four very good, and it's a girl. And it's a mare. <laughs> Should I just buy it for 15000 I mean, I'm not tight. I'm not hard up here for money. We could do. Should we just do it? <sighs> okay, mine. My horse. Okay, guys, we bought our first horse. And it's a black mare. Ah, pretty. Is it black or is it going to go grey? Probably go black like it's mum here. Uh, let's just go back to horses here. What we're going to do, we're just going to go to manage stable block. I'm going to create a new one. I'm going to call it... I don't know how to spell the breed. <laughs> how do I spell the breed's name? Norkia. Nor Norika. How do you say it? I'm actually so stupid when it comes to spells. Okay. Norika... Mess? Should we go mess? Norika mess? Okay. Ah, great. Well, I'm chuffed with this. Okay, guys. So, I'm just going to move her. So, I'm going to go to updates. Is it updates? Nope. Yes, yes, yes. And we're going to... Uh, we're going to cut that. And we're going to paste it here. And now we need a name for her. Ah, let's call her! Now, she's going to be black. So, something like Ebony. Ebony is quite nice now. Ebony's a nice name. Cool, we used to have an Ebony at our stables years ago, actually. She was really stubborn. Okay, guys, let's start basic training with this new horse here. 
so affection physical fitness is not great so um i'm just gonna pop this horse on for 45 minutes and that's one thing complete i would say the training does literally take ages if you don't log on every day is a right bone in the bum so guys that was fun we've found we, we've scanned through all the breeds and we bought our first horse but i'm not going to buy any more until you guys tell me what breeds you do on the game if you play that if you play this game at all um yeah just tell me which breeds you're doing or yeah it's gonna be well fun it's gonna be cool this might not be the only breed i do because i'm i kind of still want to do the uh canabs canabi nabs i'm hoping they bring abluses or shetlands to the game because i'll be all over that so guys thank you so much have a awesome day and i'll see you very soon don't forget to subscribe because you're gonna miss out otherwise bye